What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. Uh, where I just woke up recently, and I feel like this is too early for me because I have not really processed life, and uh, I feel like it's affecting my my general demeanor. You heard it here first, folks. But Twelve forty-five in the afternoon. Too that, early. That has no bearing on when I woke <laughs> up. I woke up at eleven forty-five, so it's like okay. Anyway, the point is, we're doing this omniscience draft, and we got Elk Tears and Biovisionary here. Hi. And Hi. this draft is draft three packs and keep the cards you draft, but with a twist. You don't have to pay in the mana cost for spells you cast. That's my biggest problem with magic is having to pay the mana cost for the cards. So once you get rid of that, it's smooth sailing. No need to put lands in your deck. Oh, wow, so we just get to draft 40 straight cards? You'll also get one mana of each color each turn to use for abilities, and every player starts with three cards in their hand instead of set. Oh, wow. All right. Let's do it. I'm a little disappointed. That's oh, here's a good, here's a good one. Oh, right. There's a good one. Turn one bells and lock. I'm game. That's pretty hot. Yeah, I don't think there's going to be a better pick than that. Well, there is a Pardic Wanderer. And a Navigator's Compass. Okay. If you want Navigator's to Compass is a really good card. I and a Fixing, which I think we need in this deck. Ooh, Time of Ice. I like Time of Ice, too. I also like Blessed Light. Wow, Skittering Surveyor really at its worst at this format. How do Syncopates work? Like, do you just cast it for zero, or can you choose what can X you, is? Can it be in infinite? It doesn't make sense to be infinite, because if you had, like, a Banefire, you just kill them on turn one. Well, that's why they did it with a set that didn't have Bane Fire. But it has Jaya's Immolating Inferno. I don't know. Well, and we we'll get, definitely get that, like, pack get three Washington pick one. On the horn to ask him? I just want to know how it works. Why you turn on? Sure. Whatever. It's either Time of Ice or Blessed Light. Time of Ice or Blessed Light. I think Black White's a better archetype, but I do like think Time of Ice. Oh, it doesn't matter. We don't have to have the color. We don't, we don't have mana, right? Like, yeah, you could take anything oh, you Oh, God. Want. That's too good. Oh, that's interesting. Yep. Well, you already have two legendary. Oh, wait, no. You only have one legendary. Yeah, these don't count, surprisingly. That's a historic. Wait, do they? No, no. It's a historic. Oh, yeah, it's, it's yeah. historic, but it's not It's, it's not, not a legendary, legendary. Sort, uh, legendary yeah. creature planeswalker. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, I think we only get five mana a turn, so I don't think you actually get to go infinite with those X spells. Well, that's for activated abilities. Yeah. Wait, Beer Guy Ed, where did it, where did it say X spells, too? Yeah, I, I don't think it says X spells. Abilities. It says, like here, it says add... Um, you also get one man of each color for each turn to use for abilities and every player. So it doesn't say, it doesn't say, can you kick things for free too? Kick your mom for free. Well, I'm sure oh, she appreciates it. I like, do like Dark Bargain. It just Oops, finds dude. more, more fat boys. I feel like card draw is at a premium in a, in a format where you only get to draw three cards in your opening hand. Do, 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 do. What about 5-4? Did we do we figure out how the syncopates work? No, I don't think there's any way to know. We'll find out. Cause or not, because we don't have them. They potentially could be very good. Or they could potentially be blanks. I'm just going to take the 5-4. I feel like it's if you take anything that costs less than oh, like 4 mana. Oh, I like mana. Balanced Soothsayer. Really? I guess Divination is pretty solid, too. I do like Divination. I mean, I you're always going to have mana up for this, right? Like, as yeah, long as you don't activate your thing. that's kind of why I like it. You can basically, anytime they try to kill a guy, you just draw a card. Yeah. Yeah, I like that better. Oh, we can take Yargle, and we can come Bargle. Grow, or just grow from the ashes, do literally anything? No, it's you put basic lands into play. Well, we have like Dark never... Bargain, so we have to take Yargle, because that's the combo. What's, what, How what? is it a combo? Oh, just because of the artwork? No. Because Yargle's come to Bargle. Oh, I see. That's true. Is, Dar is Yargle on the Dark Bargain artwork? No, but it's it's just a meme, man. It's a stream meme. You're really no, no, going but, too deep but here. But what is on the Dark Bargain artwork? I don't know. Who like is a... that? Isn't that Yargle? No, look how small it is. Maybe that That's guy funny. is really big talking to him. Tyler Jacobson did the art and Jehan Chu did the art for that one. Big shout out to Jehan Chu. Kicker also uses mana from your pool. Oh, so you can activate the ability to add five mana, and then you can add that to whatever you want. I see. That makes sense. So if you get single, you can only do it once a turn. Right. I can't imagine needing it more than once a turn. Though. Wow, there's a lot of dark bargains. People just don't appreciate these. Just kidding. That's not how drafting works. Bath taters, what's going on, my dude? It's either Partic Wanderer or this Dark Bargle. The Partic Wanderer came back. I think it's Bardic Wonder. That card was underrated. Yeah, it was just very big. Oh, look, another one. Are we just going to have mono 5-5s five in our deck? 
Yes. Okay. I mean, in a format where uh, you literally can play anything on turn one. In a one. world Actually, this where you can play anything <laughs> on turn one. With Jan Michael Vincent's. But right, doesn't that make sense to have the most expensive spells? Like, yeah. there's no, there's no point. In well, that's a, why I'm doing it here. Yeah. That's why I'm doing it. How dare you talk to me like that? I will sell you to Fair Angel is circus. Here. I agree with you. That's why I'm doing it. The first eruption, aka prom night. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I like Shiv and Fire here. Can you could kick that for free, right? You get caught up in the Shiv and Fire. You'll get caught up in the Shiv and Yeah, you can kick that. You just have to <laughs> activate your thing first. Well if we took Lana War Elves, then we could have six mana a turn instead of just five. Wow. You're right. You're right. I am right. Quote fifty eight. Wow. This returns two creatures and also a bunch of lands. Elk Tears, Elk Tears. Does whatever an Elk Tears does. Can he swing from a web? No, he can't. He is an elk. Watch out. Here comes Elk Tears. <laughs> That's, That's true. I can't swing from a web. Song of Frey, uh, I guess Song of Frey at least doesn't do it. It's the first not, two modes are not great. It's not a, at its premium in this format. I think there's Llanowar Elves. I feel like this is what a weird just play to do this. Five fives every turn. Yeah. Unless we're missing something, I don't see why taking the most expensive spell in each pack is not the correct move. I feel, yeah, it feels weird. Like, your opponent's going to play this, and we're just going to, like... I mean, who's going to play anything, like, less than that? Yeah. There's no point in, like, drafting... Ooh. When you have infinite mana, that seems pretty good. I mean, you can activate this t once a turn. Like, once on your turn, once on their turn, right? Well, so... Do I, ha do I have the rules right? So you could literally cast that on turn one by paying nothing, and then also have the mana to activate it. And then activate it, it on the same turn, turn yes. That's of insane. Course. Lebo, thank you so much for the sub. Really Soul appreciate it. Welcome back, buddy. Good here, right? Return two crew up to two creature cards. Um, probably. I feel like with all these like. Gorger or... actually seems really good, right? Like you can just kick yeah, this the same turn. That. Like you can play this and kick it the same turn. It's just an eight-eight. Well, on I mean, turn that's one. usually what you would do, anyways. That's true. Yeah, you usually kick it on the same turn. But you'll you'll, you'll definitely have. I a feel man like with it. all the fatties that we're getting in the limited card draw, you have. Uh, Oh, how many legendaries do we have? I think we have enough. No, I don't think Yargle, so. Yargle and Demon, Demon Lord. Lord. Part, uh, no. ca ca oh, we have, oh, right, that's what, oh, take it. Just take it. I mean, Let's live the dream. I don't think there's a better card in the pack than this. It's funny because in regular draft, this one is fine, but add the emblem, it's all about turn one kills. What's the turn one kill? Is that like a combo? Is the combo connected to the neck bone? Well, turn one kills would literally be like your opening hand is your three most expensive creatures and you just play them all in turn one. You only go play one spell a turn, right? Oh, did it say that? No, no maybe you don't. I don't, yeah, think, I don't think, so. think it said that. Oh, God. Why was I thinking that? No. Oh, God, I'm going to vomit. It's Take just, another Yargle. I mean, that's probably the best card in this. Especially since we just took uh, Karn's Temporal Sundry. Is this card good, though? Like, on turn one, you play Caligo Skin Witch and make them discard two of their three cards. That actually seems If really you're on the good. play. That actually seems really good. That seems like the tech, right? No, oh, this guy's just the biggest thing you can get. Navier's compass. Opening hand is a bunch of draw spells, then you go off. That's why you need to grab all the draw spells. Oh! oh. That makes more sense since you can play yeah. more than one spell a turn. All right, yeah. we should prioritize Dark Bargains and Divinations then. Actually, that's probably playable. Turn one pizza flavored combos. <clears throat> These cards are all terrible. Hmm. Does that do anything? I don't know. I mean, it's hard. You can you can make five copies of it the turn it comes into play, right? Mm -hmm. Like if you have enough spells in your hand. Well, you need another historic spell. Right. And that. But I mean, like, you get five mana, so you'll have. Blessing? Oh, Guy's Blessing? Yeah, I guess that's true. It cycles at the very least. Yeah, that's actually a good point. 
Man, this format's hard. Like, I'm trying to wrap my head around this format. Actually, another sh this guy's not terrible just because it regenerates, right? It gains indestructible. Oh, sure. sure. And it's free. Take another what? What were you going to say? Shivenfire. <sighs> I'm wondering how many things Shivenfire is actually going to kill in this format. Oh, that's true. Maybe Academy Drake, turn one, four, four, flyer. Yeah, I agree with that. Um... Thank you. Cal Critic, thank you so much for the for the sub. Really appreciate it, buddy. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, I guess we'll just take the Academy Drake. Tetsuo. It is a legendary dude. Final Tets parting search for two cards. Tetsuko. Uh, what did I say? Tetsuo? Yeah. Yes. I'm thinking of Akira. Story of my life. I think this is actually the correct pick. Over Blink of an Eye? I guess Blink is actually pretty good. Yeah, we'll take the Blink. It draws a card and it bounces. Oath of Teferi. You do nothing. This pack's pretty rough. Oh, Dark Bargain. There you go. Yeah, that's good. Dark Bargain Tribal. Wizards Retort. Dark Bargain. That's a that's free. That's a free counter spell. It's true. Man. And if you have a wizard, you get one mana for casting it. Grow from the ashes doesn't do anything. Holy shit, Mike's a girl now. Hey, Durzo language, please. How How is... Family-friendly stream. Yeah, how is Grow from the Ashes any good? I'm curious. Who said that? It's Polar Spur. That's what you responded to. Oh. More mics on streams? That, that, that's female Mike and jacket Mike. Um, that's lady Mike to you. Wow. Uh, Wizards Retort? Or Matthew, or this is Biovisionary and Elk Tears. You're a little late to the party. He is. He's late. Matthew Ori, were you on around for the 15-hour stream? He was not. I don't believe. Oof. He usually makes his presence known. With fans like these. Oh, it was a joke. No, you don't have to apologize. I just didn't get it. I wasn't sure I was missing anything, because this format's kind of... It's kind of complicated. Does Urza's like. Tome do anything? Wait, Sergeant of Arms, you could literally kick it on turn one. Yeah. It's pretty good. And it's pretty good, because it gives you a bunch of blockers, I guess. No, no. Uh, Sergeant again? Yeah. Ooh. Oh. That's pretty good. That seems pretty good. It'd be really funny if we miss one like detail of how to draft this, and it's like you have to stick with two colors. So, like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. At the end, they're like, "You built your deck wrong. <laughs> Sorry, dummy." All right, let's get into the important stuff. How was Magiana? It's one of these two. It was amazing. It was delicious. We ate way too much food. Magianas was very good. It was a very unique experience. That's right. It was your first family style experience. I'd never been to Magianas before. No. Um, it was very fun. I did eat a lot of dairy. Uh, but overall, it was delicious. What would you say your favorite, your favorite dish was? Um, of the whole meal. Start probably the, the, what was that ZD pasta we had? I can't remember the name of it. Uh, the rigatoni arabiata. Yeah. That was pretty good. That was very good. And nice uh, ricotta. Elk Tears is crazy. What Name one crazy thing I'm doing, Matthew Worry. Um, Existing. Well, that's true. Um... Elk Tears, how awesome is Mike B in real life? Um, he's pretty awesome when he's not asleep. Which is most of the time, I, unfortunately. I haven't seen a lot of them. I did think it was kind of odd yesterday when we were watching the movie, he just kind of like walked out of his room and went, went, to, went to his car and didn't even like, say hi. That's what he does. He does he that to me all the time. He just went to work. That's I'll odd. be sitting on the couch just he's watching out. TV and he's going to be like, hey man, what's up? Like he just literally just walks in the kitchen, does a thing and leaves. And I was like, eh, it's very strange. This hand seems. Wait, why do we have Power Stone Shard? Because we can only cut two cards. We have to, uh, we have to oh, have this to is actually probably day. terrible. This is probably worse than any other card in our deck. That's I. That's a good question. I actually. It's really hard to, to remember these things. I think we just keep this and play Bells and Lock. Yes. Oh God, who's on the play here? I think my favorite was also the Rigatoni, though the lemon cake was still also delicious. Polar Spur, thank you. This is actually a hungry Howie's jacket. I like to went to the wrong side there. Oh, they mulliganed? Fascinating. We kind of mulliganed as well, I guess. 
Uh, I'll take this guy. Wait. I kind of, I guess I was not paying attention to the deck building. Oh, wow, right this now. is your hand. All right. What's, what's, what's question? So, you, you only so draft 42 cards total, and you, your deck is 40 cards, so you can only, right. you can only not play two cards. Right. 42 cards? Yes, you all cards are zero mana. No, you draft 42 cards. There's no land in the packs. Uh, so they're 14 right, card right, packs. Right, right. I mean, having a 6-6 six, six flyer on turn one when they have Chainer's Torment and, and Gaia's seven, Blessing six. seems pretty okay. Seems good. Seems good. Uh-oh. Wow, it's the mirror match. All right, Cobble Blings one time off the top. We don't even have that. Are you going to Gaia's Blessing? Use Gaia's Blessing for randomness. So you don't, don't, don't wait, man. Come on, Extreme Steve, too. Is Guy's Blessing? I know you're not as good as the extreme, the, the original Extreme Steve, but you still gotta live your life, man. I want to see what happens when someone plays Teferi on turn one. I don't. No one wants that. It won't be us, so... Well, what were the two that, that you cut, do you remember? Uh, They're like Tolarian Scholar and Charge. Yeah, absolutely should be. Can't replace uh, replace power stone charge. Oh, that's pretty good. All right, here we go. It's actually not bad. Whenever a creature invoking shows dealt damage, put a one one. Ca oh, what dealt damage? Period. I'm game. Why do they have all these cards in their hand? You have five mana for activated abilities every turn. That's true. This has got to go. Yep. Okay, that's fine. It's a lot of life. Oh, that is. I mean, this guy's still a six six now. We have, we have twelve power and flyers on board. So. With it. We get to deal them twelve, and then they take. Then this becomes a. They they lose three life, and this becomes a three three. Yeah, that seems good. Let's do that. I really want them to divest us just to see a power stone shard. I I don't. I want to never. Uh, so it's two damage target creature. Whenever a creature, yeah. So it does nothing. Keep it secret. Keep it safe. Oh, that's pretty good. You can blink your own bells and lights. I can blink it now, right? Yeah. And then just replay it? Yeah. <laughs> and do we have exactly for kicker? Oh, that's gas. Well, don't play everything. Why not? Because what if they have a board wipe? Put two cards in your hand. What, what board wipe are they going to have? They're Urza's, gonna have... Urza's Ruinous Blast. And we'll, keep, we'll keep Soul Salvage in hand. That exiles. They're not going to have a legendary creature, man. Yeah, but they can have Urza's Ruinous Blast in hand, then draw a legendary. Okay, well, I'll take my chances. We're having fun. This is embarrassing. No one no one can know. You got it. Nice 3-3. Three, three. It is cool art. It, it is actually. Like look, it's a little token. cutie. <laughs> oh, God, they're going to know. <laughs> scoop. Scoop now. Oh, they took the power stone shark. Dang. My shame is so real. We could have shot this guy, too, in Delta 2. Our deck seems sweet, even though we messed up real bad with this Power Stone shard. How you doing over there? Um, my legs are getting a little cramped. I'm readjusting. Usually the chairs are switched. If you're in the front, you get the bad chair because it's only fair. We can switch. But it's not. It's, okay. It's not like a. It's not like there's no rule. Yeah. You know? We'll we'll switch after the next commercial break, or during the next commercial break. Man, that that match was pretty ridiculous. Did you show the things we did? We did all the things. There's a lot of things that happened. 
I'm about to bust. Yes. I was about to bust. Um, this seems good. Frank, can we see your chair set up? It's literally just three chairs. So, Polar Spur, I'll break it down for you. It's, um, Frank is sitting in his very nice Herman Miller chair. Beside him, by a visionary, is sitting in Frank's old Herman Miller chair. And I am sitting on what appears to be a dining room table chair that has been brought into the bedroom. That is correct. Hey, sir, thanks so much for the bits, buddy. Really appreciate it. What's in their hand if they only played one card on turn one? Counter spells. Really? Because they didn't counter anything? Because <laughs> they didn't think it was worth paying there. Wow, that's, a, that's aggressive. Okay. All right, I'm real confused now. Do I even? I'm gonna play this because if they even if they wipe the board somehow, we still get to draw two again from this guy. Eating a sandwich. Eating a sandwich. <laughs> Varsity Mike and Polka Dot Mike in the house. Varsity Mike. How many names have we had now? A lot. No one can decide. So I've okay. gotten a uh, Velvet Mike. The Velvet Under Mike. Sexy Mike. Um. Camp Counselor Mike, Varsity Mike. Um, Wait, why did they play Soul Savage but they didn't replay the guy that they? Okay, yeah, they. What's even happening I don't think right now? I understand how this format works. Um, I th he probably thought he got to keep the cards. He probably had a hand. <laughs> he probably had a handful of, of uh, Power Stone cards. Like you do. Well, why didn't you play them then? Well, he was ashamed. Well, I, that that player did not strike me as someone. Hey, do you want to open these packs? Eating a sandwich. Thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Sure. Welcome back. So, uh, yesterday we, um, drafted, uh, Frank Lepore's Vintage Cube, his paper Vintage Cube, and, um... Keep. I posted our I decks in the Discord, if anybody's curious, um, what we drafted. I had a pretty, pretty sick mono green deck that had, uh, Channel Emrakul, which I was able to do... Otherwise known as Chemrakul? Chemrakul. Um, which I was able to do twice during the draft. Uh, I went to the finals with it, um, but ended up losing the finals to a deck that had both Ancestral Recall and uh, Time Walk. That were one of them was passed to him by someone who was <laughs> kind of kind of new new to cube drafting. New to so life. it's kind of bad beats, but we did Dang. have a very intense full three game set. I didn't get plowed over or anything. Um, Elf Tears is the quarterback on the varsity squad of Frank City Howie's. Oh, that's pretty good. Turn one bells and lock into Karn's Temporal Sundering. Do we just win? Yes. yes. We bounce this? this oh is my a, god. Yes. Turn one. Unless they have counter spell. They have no they have cards, no cards in, in hand. hand. Wait, target player first. You. Also, we can make them discard it with Calico Skin Witch. I mean, don't, I think you just win this turn. You put, you put, you're putting 20 power on. 13, 14, 15, 16. Yeah, but you get to attack with the 6-6. Six, six. No, everything came into play this turn. Oh, my bad. Yeah. Not quite. Uh, does this do anything? Tap a creature controls? No. Wait, how do we just draw that? Because we draw for our, the turn. Our extra turn. Oh, right, I got it. I'm actually tempted to see if I can, like, sack the crappy guys. I think we're going to do that. For what? Oh, just to put more power on board? Yeah. Like, I don't need a 1-3. I'd rather just draw a bigger card. Plus, we have Soul Salvage, so if we sacrifice two guys... Pretty sneaky, sis. So, this just draws us a card. Well, you could play Soul Salvage, get those guys back, replay them, and then sack them again. I don't have the mana. We only have one mana. Oh, for the activated abilities, correct. Yeah. Uh, and search, draw particle under, <laughs> sergeant at arms, this kicker. We don't have enough mana for that. Play a soul salvage, attack these two idiots. Play this guy. And your go opponent. And turn. that was pretty. That was pretty good. That was a good turn, I guess. I didn't think it's draw two here, but yes. I'm mean, gonna have to deal with Bells and Lock and Trampley Boy and Thorn Elemental. Oh, this also assigns damage as if it wasn't blocked, so like all of these are basically going to the face. Until they go. 
spared into Urza's Ruinous Blast. GG, scrub. So anyway, uh, I went 2-1. It was pretty fun. And the prize payout was Ultimate Masters Packs, of which I won 2. I went 1-2, and it was probably my worst performance. With it. it was my worst performance. I think I was 13-0 or 11-0 before this with that cube. So... Uh, I went 1-2. It was very disappointing. It's not ideal. I really like my deck. It was pretty good. I've saved the packs and I'm gonna open them now on stream. Well, one at a time. This doesn't seem that good. It doesn't, but is two cards gonna be better? Like this is actually no, it's just a cycles, free card. Yeah. yeah, I'll keep it. I don't think you should ever mulligan in this format. It doesn't feel good going down to two. Yeah. Uh, around the play. Uh, I'll target myself. I will submit. You gonna open that pack, my dude? Yeah. So right. for the prize payouts, um, we played it. <laughs> wow. We played a local store and we all chipped in uh, ten bucks towards the prize pool, and then they contributed the packs for the for the play for the prizes. Whenever I go to a store and I cube draft, and I take like seven other players away from the store to cube draft, we always pay the the shop for the draft, so five ten dollars into the prize pool, and then the store will pr have a prize payout for us. I don't know if anybody else has experience opening. I did a lot of paper UMA drafts. Not on. And I did not. They, the packs feel so weird. It's like they have too much like air in them or something. Oh, it's a slim. Voda. All right. Well, here we go. That's the real slim voda. It's okay. You have a four or five hex proof. Um. So I will spare. We'll spare everyone the commons. I also didn't like how the Ultimate Masters packs are backwards. I'm very weak and can't open packs, so that's why I don't draft. <laughs> oh, see, pernicious dude, the packs are super weird. They got a little notch to tear them open, and the material is all different. Yeah, yeah. Agreeing with you. Yeah, right, Hodgkin. They feel like they've been opened or something. Yeah, they're all loose, and I really don't. It's really tilting how, like, like I can't. I'm not immediately showing you the cards right now because I'm like carefully, not to ruin what the rare is. I'm carefully like going through it backwards because they put them. They put them backwards. Not to put too fine a point on it. Say I'm the only bee in your bonnet. Put a little birdhouse in your soul. Okay, here we go. So. I'll look at the comments. First uncommon. Wow, we just won that game. That was oh, incredible. What happened? We won. Oh, uh, we tapped down their guys, then we had time of ice. I don't know, man. Good job, dude. Uh, first uncommon is Swift Reckoning. That's a good one. We we opened that one. We opened had two of those in our and reanimator deck. We went one two. Pretty uh. Pretty sneaky, sis. Wow. That's my line. No, it's not. It's Connect Four's line. Uh, You'll get caught up in the Connect, Connect Four. Four. Swift Reckoning, pretty pretty powerful card from. Uh, I don't Magic like this. Origins. This hand's bad. No, it's not that good. But don't mulligan. Really? I just like. This is a blank. I, I feel like we just you just don't mulligan in this format. I would trade two have... of these for any creature in hand. Okay, fine. Yeah, I think that's infinitely better. Right, that is pretty good. I'll keep that on yes. top. <laughs> wow, that's insane. Oh, they know they know the tech. All right, next one common is furnace celebration. This is one of the cards I personally thought was kind of like a glitch card in this set as part of the aftermath of them having to combine two master sets together. Yeah. I don't think there was a, a truly a Furnace Celebration deck or like a black, red, aristocratic sacrifice deck. It's a little scary. Wow. Why is the one an O2? Because he unwound it, or he befuddled oh, it, rather. that's interesting. Okay, well, that's all you got. Uh, put two in your hand, this guy and this guy. Uh, well, like Wizards Retort here. And Yargle. Actually, Soul Salvage might be better. Like, we're putting in three dudes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And, like, yeah, let's do these two. That's a very worse use of Yargle back. Oh, that's true, because they go to the graveyard. We can actually get Sergeant, Sergeant and Yargle back. Yeah, that's a good point. You just do that to I don't think so. 
Uh, well, actually, maybe. I mean, what what are like? I mean, we like, can't kick this guy this turn, right? I mean, I but guess like, you get your seven seven back if you want to trade for it. Well, the points are free, right? I, I like this. I'm never gonna have to. It's not like I have to conserve the mana this turn sure. to get it back. My last uncommon is Lava Spike. I think that's like one of the few uncommons that are worth maybe a dollar or two in this set. Um, Say I'm the only. And my rare. Sign damage is over. No. Bom, bom, bom. Daybreak Coronet. Meh. Press the button. Isn't that card good though? Like, I mean, it's a. It used to have some value. I don't think it Do we get Gargle or do we get Sergeant? Sergeant might be better. But Yargo's got a big old booty. No, we're not gonna really, Sergeant. actually. Not having a big old fronty, but I said booty. There's a blend. You're uh, killing it, uh, letting us know what uh, all these cards do that I'm showing. You're both the hero we need and the one we deserve right now. I feel like our board is doing quite well. All right, so I'm gonna resolve that one. Resolve that one. This is actually infinite combo. That's insane. Because you return the historic permanent, and then the Cabal mm -hmm. Paladins just trigger infinitely. So, that's pretty scary. Sure. Uh, time of Ice and yeah, that seems insane. Um, I will keep these two. Yeah, we can sack all your one ones. We can sack everything. Um, I really I want to tap this guy because I want to force you to block. Put a little birdhouse in your soul. Everyone coming in? Uh, we gotta keep two guys back. I What's think. up, a young ram? Welcome back. How'd the job interview go? Was that was him. that was not him? That was not him. Still not, still not him. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, a young ram. What is this worm? Your mom. Got him. Did you? Not to put too fine a point on it. Hey. Uh, this is a nice worm. Jink eighty seven's not listening. Where are you showing? <laughs> the like, this is a nice room. <laughs> the camera's right there, duh. <laughs> it's a good time. It's kind of see through. Okay. You're a worm now. You're Aren't a worm all... now, Harry. Oh my god, that seems. Uh oh, spaghetti is. How are we so good at this format? This is unbelievable. Man, that I don't want to play this one with six. No, that's scary. Thanks, Durzo, for the your whole deck card is on like the worm token. Big, big cards, right? Because it draws, it draws for redraws for, for uh, spells, right? If the convert mana cost is four or greater, repeat four, it. Yeah. yeah, that's why we've drawn like three or four cards off it every single time. This I card, mean, this card's busted. In this it's format. agreed. The only bells and luck is pretty but OP. I think when you're below ten life, it's scary. I don't want to draw seven off this guy. Actually, and kill it didn't myself. work. This is worm W U R M. The six six trample, but it it, it did work sure. just for a different worm. All right, should I open this other pack? Yes. Got him. Are we under? Are we like five zero right now with this deck? Yes. Bragmite. That we opened. You're on my team. Am I? No, I don't think so. Actually. No, I am. You're great. Wow. All right. I hope I get a better rare than Daybreak for a net. You doing okay over there? Okay. Keep. Snap, keep, and we go first. Oh, boy. You're a grave scrabbler. Love. Oh! <laughs> Do we just keep Bells and Lord Dark? Just oh, go. God. Just go. YOLO. Oh my god. Do Bells and Lock first, though. Dang it. Oh, that's like. Wait, you could blink Bells and Lock. Oh my god. Why the, Why not? Well, why the heck not? This guy has three to kick, four to kick. Damn, we can't do both. Oh, this, hit, this is busted, dude. We're storming. <laughs> We're storming. <laughs> Storm count. I feel like this format. Is oh my god! Stop count. pushing me I'm over. I'm pushing you, my legs. I'm not pushing you, my legs. I have long legs, everyone. 
five five or it's four five. In the middle. No spoilers on Captain Marvel. It was really good. I enjoyed it highly and probably. Oh wow, they're just like, times. all right, you start with seven cards and a Demon Lord Bells and Lock, I guess. <laughs> that was insane. We stormed <laughs> off. <sighs> See, you can still win with Storm and not have pendulum. Jesus. Alright guys. Second pack. First uncommon. Meringue River Prowler. Lemon Meringue River Prowler. That sounds delicious. Second uncommon. Travel preparations. That's what you're about to do. Yes, I am. I'm leaving today, guys. Right at the end of the stream. Frank, you did good. You did yeah, this deck is sweet. I think Demon Lord I, I want to thank Demon Lord Belsenlock for all the help. Alright. Third uncommon. Counter squall. Counterspell? Counter squall. Oh, and the rare Maelstrom Pulse. Meh. And the foil? That's not how you that totally works. You totally failed your own I don't even know how to, I don't even know how You don't know how your stream works. Foil last gasp? Oh, look at it's the battle bond art. And the too. token? Last gasp. Wow, this is, looks really dark with the green screen. This looks like a zombie four four elemental. Well, we know it's a green token. Is it a beast? Eating a sandwich. This is the weirdest episode of Open Boosters I've ever seen. Thank you for the bits. That's my song I wrote. I like it. No one wants to play us against us because our deck is so OP. <laughs> yeah, the word's out. Everyone's everyone's on things. Arena We're Reddit. Like missed what? Oh, no. We're finally meeting again for the elkiest of visionary times. I see you have abandoned all the lands in your deck. Somehow I was thinking we'll still get mana screwed. <laughs> Wait, this literally is the best format for you because <laughs> it's impossible to get screwed. I can't get flooded. flooded. Yeah, it's amazing. What that's store do you go to? You're somewhere in the Tampa area. That's where I grew up. So I know. Um... When I go to stores, I go to usually short stops. It's in Palm Harbor. But uh, I really don't play that much Paper Magic, to be honest. What does that mean? No, don't. That's not. That's a meme that doesn't work. It's like no one's going to get that. Basically, by Paper Magic, Frank <laughs> means playing Magic the Gathering with the physical paper cards at <laughs> local game shops, uh, Magic oh, Fest, Lord. or Mythic Championships. Okay, is this broken? I don't know what's going on here. Why haven't we started right, yet? I probably should go back down, because we're probably missing things. So, Frank, are you splitting your bits with your sweet co-host? Yeah, I, they question. get 33 cents of every dollar. If this is open booster, someone needs to keep saying, The craziness! Open boosters? What does that mean? Oh, wait. I don't know what's going on. I wonder what my comments were. When one Frank popped in, he brought his computer. I did. I was like, all right, I'll load up Magic Online. You just tell me what you drew each turn. I'm going to go through some of the comments. This is one of my favorite cards from uh, Eldritch Moon. Thermo I think it's Alchemist. broken. I can't cancel. Is the program dead? You killed it because of... The did we break good. the format and then they're just like, yeah. all right, cut it off. Cut it off, cut it in. Let watch me this. Begin. Watch, we're gonna have entered a match and lost it already because of like a well, glitch. So this we is gonna can be afford a loss. one loss. I don't want a loss that way though. That doesn't mean well, I no, want it. I don't want it either. Not to put too fine a point on it. Say I'm the only bee in your bonnet. Put a little birdhouse in your soul. All right, we're looking. Do we sure? Okay. All right. Look, Ma, Look Ma No Land says this happens to me all the time. Huh. Really? Mom, get the sleeve. Ma, the sleeve. That's from the. Ma, the sleeve. So in case any y'all missed it, my ears right here. Hey. Wait, where? Oh God. In case any y'all missed it, we did a 15-hour stream on Wednesday, and the entire 15 hours are available as a vod on Keep, Twitch. Yes. So. You should definitely check that out. Just pl have it. If there's a bells and lock in the Dude, first two, soul salvage is such a combo with the dark dark bargain. Sorry, Courtney, you were saying. That's like they literally whip. Oh, kidding. that's great. You're what? I was just promoting the 15 hour stream because people can go back and watch it. Any chance of mod? No, no, probably not. Like I have guests, so like it's it's probably not gonna happen until next week when I'm when I don't when it's just regular streaming time. If that works for you, Danny. 
Nice ops. Oh my god. Uh oh, uh oh. They're about to win. I don't think so. They have nothing on board yet. Oh, oh, they're, oh. They're, they won. Okay, now they're getting a little aggressive here. I think you need to hire Biovisionary for your adverts. Focus AF. Rob was feeding Frankie. It was meaning of the life for at least three seconds. Oh. Yes, there was a, there's a clip of that. There's a clip of, uh, of tears stroking Rob's beard. It was a very special moment. Okay, don't but care about that. Seems weird. Why would you cast that now? It has flash. I don't know. This is all very strange. All right. Oh, we get to draw a fourth card too. That's pretty cool. Oh, that was actually great. Because you could kill the. Yeah, player. and they could have flashed this into exile. This right to flicker it, not exile it. Well, no. If you do return it to the battlefield under storm's control, being an exile. Well, flickers until the end step, so it's yeah. more like a flicker wisp. Bells and luck. Bells and luck. One time. Oh. Okay. Yeah. There you go. That's what you get. It's weird passing the turn with no creatures in play. Hollow Point 51 says pub subs on sale. They are. All pub subs are on sale for $5.99 right now. You should make the whole 15 hour stream VOD available on two laser discs or one DVD for three easy payments of $29.99. That's actually a good idea and a good deal. Correct. I like that idea a lot. We did finish with Momir Basic. Like, it was a lot of fun. Those good times. The whole stream was a lot of fun, I feel like. It was not too miserable. Meh. For being 15 hours. It's funny how meh removal spells seem in this format. Say I'm the only bee in your bonnet. Put a little birdhouse in your soul. Ooh, they have the Mirari conjecture. That's scary. What are you going to get? Oh, they're going to get divination back? Get yeah, and, this is and nuts, dark dude. Bargain. Well, they already got, they already got Wizards of Tort back, so oh. why would you wait till next turn where this doubles? That seems greedy. What's a pub sub? It is a sub from uh, the food the food supermarket Publix. As opposed to the other kind of supermarket? That's how you want to be. That's where you want to be when Jesus comes back. I want to be my best self. You should. Everyone's playing this just because it cycles. Like, and that's I think that's actually fine. Bonus 30 minutes with exclusive Momir drafts for $39.99. Yeah, you can it's really upcharge the bonus content. I feel like we found our... Oh! oh maybe not. That's kind of scary. Well, you do have Karn's Temporal Sundering. Yeah. We're... Oh, they have they have Wizard's Tort. This... Oh, we have Soul Salvage. Oh. Right. Oh, wow. They just let this resolve? Uh-oh. That's kind of annoying because Shut now up, they can move toward the... Uh... Also, we drew the worst card off of Elk that. Tears donating a dollar. Very nice. Wow, oh, how did you do that? He's in I, the back. Because I love you guys. No, I said how, though. On my phone. I don't even see your phone. Oh, you're like a ninja. He just he just did that because he gets 33 cents of it. That's true. Yes, yeah, so you gave like, a dollar so get, you can get 33 cents. Exactly. That's this I get, is good. It's basically I'm like I'm paying uh, 67 cents to seem like a really good guy in stream. That's just a smart investment. I shouldn't reveal my secrets. Uh, uh, house in your I guess we should update the who. Yeah. Rob is not here. And Mike is not here either. Did they steal this? How did they get our Demon Lord Bells unlock? What's happening right now? Oh, because they played this with Kicker? Yeah. I think we're dead. We had a good run. I mean, we still have two losses left. Sometimes a bad guy. Is it two losses or three? Well, you get, you get three total. So we can get... I okay. guess we can get okay, one yeah, more you do loss. Get three total. I don't know. That, no, that's what I meant. I didn't know how many total you got. Lady Mike and Jacket Mike. <laughs> it's like you do. Like you do. Who's going to order public subs and have them delivered here so we can eat them cumbersomely on stream? 
Don't do that. Okay. <laughs> It's like the it's like the billboards that Andy and Dwight had made in the office. Chat, did you hear that? Where Andy's like this. We're gonna eat Publix live on stream. Oh my god, Publix subs live on stream. I'm so excited. Public subs are sandwiches from the grocery store and they are delicious. They are definitely up in like top three sub sandwiches maybe even i don't know it's crazy i really need to try very this good. it's hard to believe a grocery store having that high quality of a sub sandwich i know Come on. bells and lock wow these are terrible impulse is at least a thing i guess Impulse is just your next best card. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay, we could take one of these. Yikes. Kerwood hashtag sandwich eating stream. That's up to you guys. This is not this is the least exciting first turn we've had. And we went through a like a lot of cards. I feel like eating a sandwich is getting pumped yeah. about this. Yeah. That would be eating a sandwich's moment for us to eat. Oh boy. On oh, that, that card actually seems pretty good. No, oh, that also seems really good. <laughs> they had a cooler turn than you did. I feel like. Wow, now Rumeha is like insane in an infinite mana format. What were you going to say? I feel like you need to experience. The full pub sub thing, like going there and picking your sandwich and your bread and like watching them make it. I see. And then having them wrap it up like a small baby. <laughs> and then you put it and then you put it in the child seat in the cart so it's safe. And then you push it to the register to pay for it. I see. It's I true, see. you do all those things. Yeah. Which you we would not get if we delivered it. But you know what we would get? The ability to not have to leave. That's true. And we can eat our sandwiches. That's a good ability. So, fun fact, okay. if anybody is sending us sandwiches, I don't eat meat. How do they compare to Wawa? Okay. They compare well to Wawa. Yeah, like, I'm having a hard time picking one over the other, honestly. Put a little birdhouse in Mike's soul. Hey, Mike's, what's your preferred STD decks at the moment? I, that's uncomfortable. I don't want to answer that. Oh, standard. What's your preferred standard decks at the moment? I'm liking a Dirtily Simic Adapt Brew I made that loses frequently. Uh, funny you bring that up. Frank actually p played a uh, Jund Demons deck during the 15 hour stream. That was pretty awesome. Uh, it had demons in it. Did it? Oh, that's what those things were. Is that Kibler's little brother in the background? Oh, uh, infinite combo confirmed. This Cabal Paladin double Guardians of Coilos combo is pretty obnoxious. Who? Wait, who's Kibler? What's a Kibler? What's a Kerbler? What is a Kibler? What's an Ibler? Is Kibler a, a stream reference that I'm not getting, or a movie reference? It's a actually their band. Uh oh. They go by the Kiblers. Okay, come on. Kibblers are the elves that make the cookies. Oh, you mean Keebler? I'll, I'll hear. I'll hear. I'll hear. Brian, you're talking about Brian Kibler. Kibler is that... Everybody part. knows that. Kibler? Well, he doesn't. Yes, he does. No, he He's doesn't. totally trolling. No, I doesn't. don't know that. You don't know Brian Kibler? I do not know who Brian Kibler is. I feel like he's totally trolling right now. I'm not trolling. This is the thing you do. Like, you literally, you're the boy who cried wolf. So, like, when you're actually Brian seriously, Kibler. when you seriously want information about something, I don't know what to give it to you. Is he a magic player? Shut up and take my money. He's totally trolling right now. I'm not trolling. You I have to understand, I, I, the level of casualness of a magic player I am. Like, I could maybe name five pro magic players if I really thought hard about it. He's also a Hearthstone player now, so... It, it seems like that's probably what he's more known for, right? Hearthstone? I saw someone that I like that we went 6 0 and then we just lost two in a row to the. Uh, some, we lost some ridiculous two nonsense. again. 
Well, hopefully we won't lose to it again. Wow, we didn't even start yet, and we really lost to them? Cherry Man didn't know who he was either. Is it sad I had to Google that person? No, it's not sad, because I ain't know either. And I I envy the fact that you didn't have to get shamed publicly. I didn't shame you, nor did I make fun of you. I literally just thought you were trolling me. Because that's literally what you do 90% of the time. That's true. Oh, this gives haste. That's... That's something, all right. There's a thing called Kibler Google. Oh, that's scary. They have cool legends. <laughs> How'd you go on to Elk Tears trolling? Now I've heard everything. Okay. Bells and lock. Bells and schlock. Schmells and lock. Well, we could still get. We could still do Yargo and Karn. It's true. Uh, oh, Calico Skin Witch, does that do it? That's actually pretty good. That gets rid of both their cards. I would love to take Thorn Elemental, but I think it's actually just better to Shut knock them cards out, my dude. Hot dogs are, in fact, sandwiches. Are these you? Is that true? Does That's he have his phone? Where is he making these donations? I don't understand what's going on right now. Hot dogs are sandwiches, huh? That's what I think. I think so? I, I think so strongly about it, I was willing to give up a dollar. He doesn't even have his phone! Yes, I do. Let me or see. Show me your phone. I'm not going to show you. You're on live on... We're live. Okay. We're live. You're live. This is now a sub ordering stream. I'm pretty sure it's just Kerwit. Wait, is it really? I'm pretty sure this is 100% yes. Kerwit. It is. Okay. Or is it me? I have my phone. Put a little bird I am sorry in I didn't know who Brian Kibler was. Why are you sorry about that? No, because I feel like it seems like he's a pretty obviously known. Uh, Figure in the magic uh, in gaming community. I am offended AF right now. My name isn't eating a hot dog. <laughs> this is not a debate. Oh, this is a bad one. Elk Tears has some kind of straw man donator. Shut up and take my, money. my dad was a straw man donator. Kerwood is not real. <laughs> I mean, I do think Kerwood's not real. So much so that I was willing to give a dollar to let Kerwood the frog? Shut oh, they play this and they just money. get to throw their garden back. <laughs> Elias, something or another. Hey, Elk Tears, you're a real poop head bug. Hey, damn it! Damn you, Elias! What an apple head. Nope. Elias, I. Nope. Elias, I thought Elias. So I, I, I thought Elias so at first could have been a chill person. I thought he could have been my little one. My little, my apple, little one? My little apple head. But then he ended, <laughs> but then he, but then he ended up being a total jerk. It's cringy. It's so cringy, dude. He ended up becoming a toll jerk, and now, uh, I, I'm telling you, if I had the best legal team uh, the country had to offer, I would end Elias's professional life. And if you're out there, Elias, which I know you are... You'd end his Best Buy life? Yes. I would get you fired from Best Buy so fast. How fast? Not, like, the faster than the refresh rate on a uh, 1080p TV. So pretty fast. That was a good ref That was a good Best Buy reference. Um, we're gonna go to two here, so all our dark bargles are dead. PJ, so ten hot dogs are sausages. Um, you know what? That seems better than sandwiches. This is a family-friendly stream, guys. Keep a G. What? We didn't say anything. We didn't have kept a G. What are you talking about, Applehead? Oh God! <laughs> the cringe is so real, dude. This card is actually insane. Garnet? Yeah, Garnet's busted. In this format. I used to really love Garnet in uh, in regular Dominary Draft. I feel like it was a very underrated legend. I would always get like go around really late. Not to put too fun a the, the fact that you, you could flash in and then get everything you play the next turn haste is insane. Put a little birdhouse in your soul. It's very similar to that card from... Um, I think it was Amonkhet, the Gruul legendary creature. That became a planeswalker. Steven. Oh, that's. Well, he's the one you stack to get a basic land. Oh, Richard. No, Chad. What legend am I thinking of? The, it's the gruel creature that it, like had flash and gave all your all your creatures haste. Samut. Yeah, that's it. A hot dog is a sausage, and when you put it on bread, it's a sausage sandwich. Thus, by the transitive property of sandwiches, hot dogs are Wait, sandwiches. Wait, why did they play a, another? 
so they can get back their first Garna. Oh, that's clever. And now they got back this Garna. It, they just loop. If you have two Garnas, they just loop infinitely. It's pretty obnoxious. Pretty sneaky, sis. It is indeed pretty sneaky, sister. Put a little birdhouse in your soul. Before you help them hell, give us a helping hand. Put a little birdhouse in your soul. Put a little birdhouse in your soul. Is this is this put a little birdhouse in your soul to the tune of put a little love in your heart? Yeah. And that's good. Say I'm the only uh -oh, they got a salad. They got a Zezer salad. I got a six six. We put a, we have a Hulk. That's my secret, Tony. I've I'm always, always a had five mana for activated abilities. Oh, they're not attacking. I like it. That's a freebie. Don't be mocking the subs from the supermarket till you've tried them. Who's who's doing that? They are delicious. I'm not surprised you people don't know anything about sandwiches. Wow. If you get your subs from the supermarket. Doesn't even make any sense. Who said that? Durzo? I thought you were cool, Durzo. I never did. Really? Got him. No, he's good. He's good people. Okay. If your hot dogs are floppy and useless, learn to cook. Mike, what the? That doesn't even make any sense. Oh, that doesn't if even If your hot dogs are floppy, I feel bad for you, son. I got 99 problems, but a floppy, floppy hot, hot dog, dog ain't one. one. You're right. Bow. This is so Bow. bad. Bow. What is Broken Bomb doing? It destroys an artifact or an enchantment, then you can put a land from your hand onto the battlefield. So nothing. So nothing is right. <laughs> Eldrazi Titan 87. My local supermarket subs are dope and so, so cheap. So, so cheap. But a little, why didn't they play? Oh, I guess because we just keep killing Rona, I guess. I think supermarkets can have good subs, and that can be true. But actual sandwich places can have good subs at the same time. Like, that they don't have to exclude each other. Yeah. This guy's an 8 8? My god. Um, Mother of God. Hashtag honesty stream. I'm going to honesty stream the chat. Chat. Uh, favorite flavor of Starburst? Can I answer? Cherry. Can I get in chat and answer? Well, you get in chat and answer. I just don't want okay. your answers to influence the chat because I don't want chat just to be like, oh, I want to have the same answer as Cherry Visionary. Cherry. Or Frank Lepore. The answer is Cherry. The answer is Strawberry. Cherry. Pink. There are no good Starbursts. Well, that's not helpful. Orange. I think is the best flavor. Valley Man's correct answer is strawberry. Yellow is nice for me. Or pink. Is strawberry. Lemons are also good. I do like the lemon ones. So I, I don't like the cherry ones. I think my answer undoubtedly would be... I'm so, I have long legs. I can't do anything about them. I think the answer undoubtedly for me would be... Uh, Strawberry, and in a very, very close second would be lemon. Um, and I think eating both the strawberry and the lemon at the same time is pretty euphoric. It's essentially like having a pink lemonade starburst. This is interesting. Do you have like a trick? Are you going to put a little love in your heart? Sure, you just had to literally draw one, one pump spell. Seems good. Cool. Must be nice. All right. Well, six six three, I guess. We had a good run. We did. Unfortunately, we it's over oh. now. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you're watching on YouTube, if you're watching on Twitch, we're not leaving. But if you're watching on YouTube, slam those like and subscribe buttons, and uh, you can check out meundies.com slash Frank Lepore for fifteen percent off and free shipping and free returns. You can check out uh, Mana Traders. The link is in the description. You'll get uh, twenty percent off your first three months of a subscription, and you can also check out uh, CoolStuffInc.com, and you can get 5% off with promo, promo code FRANK5. So be sure to check those out, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.